morning, Carlson. Happy third try. Let's get started with your news. Any student interested in a vocational course, please see Mrs. Palazzolo in the counseling office. There will be a mandatory meeting for all students who are interested in taking an AP course next year on Monday, March 21st at 6 p.m. in the auditorium. Students must have a parent or guardian with them at the meeting. There will be a boys and girls track parent meeting tomorrow at 6 p.m. in the cafeteria. If you are running track this season, it is mandatory to have either a parent or guardian at this meeting. Attention all boys basketball players. The boys basketball banquet will be March 17th. Tickets are $13. Make sure you get your tickets from Mr. Raymond. It is time to celebrate March's reading month. Come into the library and tell us what you are reading this month and you will be entered to win a wonderful prize throughout the month of March. Drawings take place each Friday. If you have any questions, see Mr. Piotti or any library staff member. Seniors, the scholarship spreadsheet has been updated. It is now pretty in pink. Pick one up in the counseling office. It is time to register for 2016 AP exams. Exams are $92 each. Purchasing three or more exams costs $70 per exam. Free or reduced lunch test prices will be provided as soon as an amount is finalized. The final date to sign up for the test is this Friday. If you have any questions, speak with your AP teacher or Mr. Piotti in the library. Please make checks out to Gibraltar School District. The spring Red Cross blood drive is tomorrow. The drive will take place in the Ox Gym. You must be 16 or older to donate and meet certain height and weight requirements. If you are age 16, you must have a signed permission slip. And if you are 17 or older, you can sign up at www.redcrossblood.org with the sponsor code of Carlson High School, which is all one word. If you have any questions, see Mr. Piotti in the library. Well, Carlson, that's all for your news. Have a great day, and of course, remember to show your Marauder pride. What? Hi, Carlson. It's Mr. Morrow. I'm filling in for your man, Thad. And uh, I just want to tell you that today it's going to be 56 degrees. Did you know that it's the warmest winter we've ever had? And a low of 45. So get out your shorts and your... Uh, you know, your footwear, and uh, just hang out. Oh, we have a 10% chance of rain, but I doubt it. And that's about it. Have a good day, Carlson. Good morning, Carlson. I'm back with sports. The Pistons, they're eighth in the East, and they play Atlanta tomorrow. The Red Wings, they're fourth, and they play at Philadelphia tonight. Uh, Michigan plays Tulsa tomorrow as March Madness has begun with the official tournament starting March 17th. That is in a couple of days. Michigan State won the Big Ten and they will play Mid-Tennessee State. That is all for your sports news. Everybody have a great day and show your Marauder pride. Do you like Hollywood? If you like Hollywood, join this class. You will get there. Do you like acting, filming, being a director, telling people what to do? There you go. I would suggest this class to anyone who's creative or likes Photoshop or any Adobe product. Um, if you wanted to be a news anchor or if you're good with graphics, I think that this is definitely a class for you to take. Um, it's a really cool class and I've enjoyed it for my past two years. I don't know really what I'd say to them. It just really I'd show them what we've done in the class itself, like all the videos we've done, all the skills we've learned. It's really fantastic. I found it fun. I feel like it's a good opportunity um, for newer students to explore this uh, particular field of um, digital media. You know, you have a different array of uh, skills that, you know, you can learn. I 
I kind of pride myself in letting students do a lot of their own creations as long as uh, they have good ideas. And I look at the ideas and I think about would that be a good project or not. But it's the creative process that's important. If they learn how to be creative, what works when they finally get it on the screen, and what doesn't work when they get it on the screen. And this class is not like any other class in the school. And that is why I like it so much, is because it is different. But the person has to really, really want to do this. They gotta have a passion.